What is good, YouTube? We're back. Yes, we're making another video. I'm honestly excited making to be making this video just because I have a special surprise for you guys. But anyways, make sure to like, subscribe, tag your sister and your brother, and yeah, let's jump right into this video. So today's gonna be an updated banner tutorial. Honestly, made another banner video like maybe four months ago. I don't even remember how long ago, but if you didn't see it and you wanna learn another type of banner, you can go ahead and click that tutorial right here. You can even see the thumbnail. Hey, but yeah, today I'm gonna be showing you how to create this banner right here. Obviously, I don't know what it looks like because we're gonna be creating it together, obviously. So yeah, hope you guys enjoy this and. I jump right into this so this obviously is a giveaway banner so if you guys want to win a free banner and even be in a banner or any type of gfx we're creating join our discord server come on it's free and it helps me feed my kids please but anyways so as you guys can see i have my character right here this is um let me just check um i'm gonna just call him <laughs> omega so Omega, thank you for entering and supporting our channel. Thank you so much. I can finally fe feed these goons right here. Anyways, so first thing I like to do when creating first creating my uh, banner is to first add a camera. This time, this time for the camera, what you want it to be is make sure the settings are 1920 by 1080. Make sure that your output is set to RGB uh, plus alpha because our transparent is gonna be alpha, which means background. Um, compression, I'm gonna set it to zero. Color depth, I'm gonna go ahead and set, uh, keep it at eight. Sampling, 4096. Someone honestly sent me a DM about this, but no, I'm just kidding. The noise, it's honestly for me, it's up to you and up to your computer, so. I'm gonna keep it on accurate and I'm gonna change it from uh, the open image denoise to optics. Next thing I'm gonna do is go into my camera settings and just play around with the focal length, maybe like 28. I think that's gonna be our go mode. And yeah, and this rig is made was made by was made by these two absolutely great of creators. So make sure to show them support, obviously, which. You probably know them both. Well, yeah. First thing I want to do is actually make sure is my legs are set to IK. So I'm going to go ahead and make sure this is set to 1. Go to this top, make sure it's set to 1 also. So now we can do this. And he can... Wait, what? And he can now do this, basically. Squat. So now another thing we can do is... Another thing we can do... Next thing I like to do is obviously pose our camera. For this banner, I'm, the character is going to be on the left side, I'm pretty sure this is. Yeah, this is the left side. So because the character is going to be at the left side, I'm going to be rotating the camera towards the right side. If that makes sense. So if I'm talking too fast, this tutorial is just going to be too fast. Just because of the surprise I got waiting for you. So next thing I'm going to be doing is... Honestly, pl playing around with the character till I get something I like. And one thing you do need to make sure of when, whenever you're posing your avatar for your banner is make sure the legs and torso above are showing like completely. So don't try and like cover half the torso or have some type of like cinematic like pose. Just have, just try have to have a simple pose for the banner. So. That's the only thing I can tell you. And then I'm just gonna bend the arms like this. I'll go ahead and rotate the head to where he's looking like this. And I'll go ahead and pose the camera a little bit like this. Bring it down, bring it to the side. Lower the focal length, 24. And I think this is going to be good. Just make sure. And in window mode, it looks good. And another thing I want to do is make sure I transfer back 
<clears throat> transfer it back on its own. Next thing I want to do, this is going to be the lighting port. I'm going to go to the word icon, go to um, color. I'm going to set this to not too bright, but to a point where we still see shadows in our scene. And another thing I want to do is lower the specular just because it, it looks a little bit too shiny. Not going to lie. And just like so. And I'm going to bring his leg maybe like this so it's straight. Yes, sir. And because this character is black and a mixture of white, this is going to be a black and white GFX, obviously. So I'm going to go ahead and add a white light. Make sure the power is quite bright, but not too much. 800, 801 is okay. I'm going to go ahead and increase the size of this while also increasing the power just because we lost some, some of our power when scaling the light up. And I'm going to be adding another camera above him just so we get that like shiny head effect. Next thing I'm going to be doing is adding a little bit of specular to his uh, glasses and any type of object that kind of deserves a little bit of more of a shiny feeling. I'm going to lower the roughness, bring up the metallic and specular. I'm going to also be doing this to this um, crown thing or whatever this is. And I'm going to be lowering the roughness, bringing up the metallic and bringing up the specular. That gives us better um, reflections, better sh shining and you get the point, I hope. Next thing I'm going to be doing is bringing the chain down a bit and even rotating it to where it's not stuck in him. Just like so. So I'm going to just have it maybe like this. Bring it down a bit. And just like so. Oh, wait. There we go. So now. I'm going to render this out and move this into blend, Blender, Photoshop, and I'll meet you guys there. And like any other tutorial I make, this is going to be split into two different parts. Yes, sir. <laughs> but yeah, part two should be up right now. I don't want this video to be so long, so you have a part two. This video was just Blender, as usual. Honestly, you guys at this point should get used to this, because... I don't plan these recordings, so I'll see you guys in part two. Like, sub, tag your mother.